You say you're a doctor? Yes. What of exactly? Oh, medicine, science, chemistry, anything to be honest. Do you know how my trooper died? Nope. Do you? I have my suspicions. Which are? A monster killed him. A monster? Don't be so enthusiastic. What's to be enthusiastic about? If there was a monster about, it would have sharp teeth and claws, and his clothes would have been ripped. Sharp claws, you say? That's right. Claws like these. Beep. Yes. Yes, exactly like these. By the time the commander comes back, the monster would have claimed another victim. Stay where you are, Doctor. Purely business, you know. Nothing personal. I'd think about what you're doing if I were you. What? Well, I'm simply pointing out that if you fire that gun, you'll blow your cover story. Monsters don't carry guns, you know. I'll take that risk. Goodbye, Doctor. Goodbye. Ah. <laughs> so sorry, Colonel. Robots kill. <laughs> No, not me. Not me, not me. Why are you coming for me? It seems you've been underestimated, Colonel. For God's sake, don't stand there, man. Do something. And why should I do you any favors after you try to kill me? Because this thing is gonna kill me. Please, I'm begging you. Robot, stop. Don't kill him. Hostile threat present. He must be destroyed. He is not hostile, he is a member of staff. You will not harm him, he is a friend. Register him in your computer bank. He will be scanned for analysis. Hostile threat present, he must be destroyed. What about me? You haven't scanned me. Scan me. Register confirms you are hostile. You too must be destroyed. Wait, wait. Scan the dead body. What are you doing? Just trust me. Robot, scan the dead body. This hostile threat was present. This hostile threat has been eliminated. This hostile threat has been dealt with. Go through your computer banks, your list of staff. Analyze every single one of them. <laughs> All members of staff are hostile. They will all be destroyed. Exactly. What are you doing now? Proving a point, don't you see? The robots want to kill every last one of us. You mean... Yes, the robots are behind the fever. And they're trying to destroy every single one of us who is coming on track of a cure. You, me, anyone. Everyone in this space wants to find a cure. The robots have to stop them. You will both be annihilated. What's going on? Gravis! Short scramble the robot circuits is going to kill us. It's going to kill every last one of us. <laughs> no, robot! <laughs> ah, thank you, Gravis. Doctor, what's going on? The robots, they're behind the yellow fever. What? Yes. And they're going to kill every last one of us who was on a track of a cure. What should we do? I must speak to Commander Radner. Now. What about the Colonel? He tried to kill me. I would advise you keep him under controlled supervision. Very well. Either that's come this way, Doctor. Well, what about me? You can't just leave me here. You're coming too. If what the Doctor says is true, Colonel, then I will make sure that you resign by the end of the day. Right, you two. Come with me. The feeler life form is incompatible. She must be destroyed. So now that you see, Commander, according to the doctor's conclusive evidence, we must act quickly. Well, if it's necessary. But all we know, those robots can be planning out a big mass attack. Those robots are designed to serve and progress. They don't want to kill anyone. You do not want to underestimate the advantages of technology, Commander. Believe me, 
I've seen a robot massacre and see what it can do. Supposing what you say is true. What about the colonel here? Well, with myself being an eyewitness, the colonel pointed a gun at my head and tried to kill me. He's not to be trusted. So what you're saying is, he allowed Hector's death to happen without saying a word. But why, Robix? You are one of my trusted members of staff. I panic, Commander. I figured that this doctor being new to the books, it'd be easy to frame him for Hector's death. I rest my case, and therefore, we haven't got long before those robots take over. So what you're saying, if the robots created the virus, they're a vital part of curing it. Yes. Well, in that case, we've got nothing to lose. Gravis? Yes, Commander? Inform S-14 Central Command about Robix's actions. He is to be taken into custody and under supervised control. Is that understood? Yes, sir. As for you, Doctor, come with me. We must make a report to the main authority. What good will that do? What good will that do? For a start, it will lift up the quarantine. We need to do a bit more than that. As much as I am in command here, Doctor, I do not have the authority to do so. Now, come along. Oh! Oh, I suppose you want to clean the room. Oh, very well, but hurry up. Robot, what are you doing? Hostile threat present. Destroy, 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 destroy. No, robot, no. Withdraw, withdraw, withdraw. Ah, no! Doctor, what does it carry? It's Fela, she's in trouble. Come on! No, please! It's alright, Fela, you're going to be alright. Doctor! Oh no! Get back, Commander! What's its power drive? Come on, man, where is it? It's in the bottom left compartment, hurry! Huh, I think it's safe to say we can relax. Ah, it's alright, Fila. You're going to be okay. He tried to kill me. Yes, I know, he's trying to kill every single one of us. But why? He's trying to stop us from finding a cure to the fever. So what do we need to do? Well, for a start, we can open this one up and find out what's immune in robots that isn't in humans. <laughs> Commander, come and have a look at this. What is it? What's that dripping out of its system? It's blood. Turns out there's more to this story that meets the eye. But hold on, what's that? The blood? No, 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 next to it. To the toxic fluid drive. Well, that's just nitrogen chloride. It keeps the system going. I wonder. If we make a compatible mixture of nitrogen chloride and blood, it might just form a natural substance. And along with a few other things, your medicines, your painkillers, we could perform the super drug to yellow fever. It will, of course it will be very complicated, but still, it might just stand a chance. So, that's a cure, it's a formula. Feeler, yes doctor? If you're done standing scared in the corridor, go and get me a list of medicines. All of them. We all have a chance here, you know. Ah! Get away from me!